Hey there! In this video, we're diving into everything you need to know about OBD2 trouble code P0443, also known as EVAP canister purge valve circuit malfunction. First things first, let's break down what the P0443 code actually is. This trouble code pops up when the PCM, also known as the powertrain control module, detects an issue in the circuit that controls the purge valve in the EVAP system. Now, what does that mean? Well, the EVAP system is designed to prevent fuel vapors from escaping into the atmosphere, and the purge valve plays a crucial role in this process. But when there's a problem, like a broken wire, a faulty purge valve, or even something as simple as a blown fuse, the PCM can't properly control the valve. Now let's take a quick look at how the EVAP system works. The purpose of the EVAP system is simple but vital. It's designed to prevent fuel vapors from escaping into the atmosphere, which helps reduce air pollution. Basically, it's a collection of components that create a sealed environment, capturing, storing, and eventually purging volatile fuel vapors from the fuel system. When the engine is off, fuel vapors are stored in the charcoal canister instead of being released into the atmosphere. Once the engine is running and the conditions are right, the purge valve opens. This allows those stored vapors to flow into the engine, where they're burned during the normal combustion process. And the vent valve is usually stays open, allowing fresh air to flow into the charcoal canister to ensure proper operation. Now, let's know why P0443 gets triggered. Now, let's talk about why the P0443 code gets triggered. The purge valve is an electrically controlled solenoid, and it's the PCM's job to tell it exactly when to open and close so those trapped fuel vapors can be sent into the engine at the right time. But here's the problem. If something goes wrong, the PCM loses control over the purge valve. When that happens, the PCM realizes it can't properly operate the purge valve, and that's when it throws the P0443 trouble code. Just like the P0443 code, you might also come across other trouble codes related to the EVAP system. For example, P0444 indicates an EVAP purge control valve circuit open, meaning there's a complete break in the circuit. On the other hand, P0445 means EVAP purge control valve circuit shorted, which suggests there's an unintended connection somewhere in the wiring, possibly causing a short circuit. If you want to read more about any other OBD2 codes, you can visit our website obdcode.org for a full list of codes and their meanings. Now that we understand what P0443 means and how it gets triggered, let's cover how to reset it. Sometimes, Error codes like P0443 appear due to recent maintenance or temporary glitches, and they may clear up after an OBD2 reset. To do this, you'll need an OBD2 scanner. If you don't have one, check out the link in the description for the best scanners out there. Simply connect the scanner to your vehicle, follow the instructions to clear the trouble codes, and see if the P0443 code reappears. If the P0443 code reappears, it's time to look into some common root causes of P0443. Let's discuss some common root causes of the P0443 error code. The first cause is purge valve stuck in the open or close position. If your purge valve gets stuck, whether it's stuck open or closed, it can definitely trigger the P0443 code. Now, when the purge valve is stuck open, fuel vapors continuously flow into the engine, even when they're not supposed to. This can mess with the air-fuel mixture, which might cause your engine to run rough, struggle to start, or even waste more fuel than usual. But if the purge valve is stuck closed, that's a whole different problem. In this case, those trapped fuel vapors never make it to the engine like they should, which means the EVAP system can't do its job. That could lead to increased emissions, and you might even notice a strong fuel smell around your car. Now, another possible reason you're seeing the P0443 code is an open circuit in the purge valve wiring. The purge valve is an electrically controlled solenoid, 
meaning it relies on a proper flow of electricity to open and close at the right times. But if there's a break somewhere in the wiring, maybe due to corrosion, a loose connection, or even damage from rodents chewing on the wires, the circuit won't complete and the PCM won't be able to control the valve. When that happens, it immediately triggers the P0443 code. So if you're dealing with this issue, it's a good idea to inspect the wiring harness around the purge valve. Look for any frayed, broken, or disconnected wires. Sometimes fixing a simple wiring issue is all it takes to clear that trouble code and get your car running smoothly again. Now let's talk about one of the least likely but still possible causes, a failed or failing PCM. The powertrain control module is essentially the brain of your car's engine management system, and if it malfunctions, it can misinterpret signals or fail to send the proper commands to components like the purge valve. However, I want to stress that a bad PCM is a rare occurrence. Before jumping to the conclusion that your PCM is faulty, you should thoroughly inspect all the other potential causes we've talked about, like stuck purge valves, open circuits, or damaged connectors. If you've ruled everything else out and you're still facing the P0443 code, then it might be time to consider diagnosing the PCM itself. In most cases, a professional scan tool and proper diagnostics from a trusted mechanic or dealership are required to confirm a PCM failure. Replacing a PCM is expensive and sometimes requires reprogramming, so it should always be the last resort. Another possible cause of the P0443 code is an ECU software issue. Now, sometimes it might seem like the ECU itself is faulty, but in reality, the problem could just be a software glitch. In many cases, a simple ECU reflash or remapping can resolve the issue without needing to replace any hardware. So before jumping to conclusions and replacing expensive components, it's always a good idea to check if a software update is available. Manufacturers often release updates to fix bugs and improve overall performance, so a quick reflash might be all it takes to clear that P0443 code. Another common issue is a blown fuse or faulty relay. Since the purge valve is electrically controlled, it relies on a fuse and sometimes a relay to function properly. If the fuse blows or the relay fails, the purge valve won't receive power, and the PCM will flag it as a circuit malfunction. Another possible cause is a vacuum leak in the EVAP system. Even though P0443 is an electrical circuit issue, a vacuum leak can sometimes confuse the system, making it seem like the purge valve isn't working correctly. Cracked or disconnected EVAP hoses can lead to this kind of problem. 